Eric, like you said, the Beloit Fire Department is still investigating the cause of this morning's fire. However, investigators say that materials inside of the home helped fan the fire. Unfortunately, because of just the amount of stuff in the house, the, the one victim wasn't able to get out. Firefighters say flammable materials in the home crowded with clutter contributed to the deadly fire. They believe it started in the basement where the victim, Thomas Jinx, was sleeping. The alarm woke her. Her husband was in the living room area and she woke him and they came out immediately. He tried to go back in to get the son and, and just couldn't. Joanne Korn and her husband have lived next door to the Jinx family since 1964. Korn says if it was not for the smoke alarms, the tragedy could have been much worse. You know, when glanced down that way, there was extensive smoke. And really, um, I think the good to come out of this is that everybody should have fire alarms and batteries in them because I think uh, Mr. and Mrs. Jinx would be dead this morning if it hadn't been for those fire alarms. Fire investigators say flammable materials in the home contributed to the fire. However, they're still investigating an exact cause. It just makes it difficult when they're, I mean, literally items packed floor to ceiling. Now, the fire department says one firefighter did suffer minor injuries. The Red Cross was also on scene this morning. They're helping out with medication, housing, and food for the couple. All right, Valina Jones, thank you very much. Now,